Hey everybody, what's up? Uh, here we are, Wing Chun DC tutorial number four. Um, today I want to give you guys a just an exercise, brief exercise to do um, at home um, to make sure you keep them sharp or make sure you're keeping internally structured or internally connected. So what we're going to do, uh, we're going to start with a punch series, okay? Uh, we're going to start the punch series with creating a structure, so feet together, out, heels down, straighten the legs, tuck the hips in here, straighten the back from here. Now we're going to put our elbows in front of the hips, like that. Okay, from here, we create shoulders back and down here. And what we're going to do is punch, punch number one. Okay, and we're going to come back. Then we're going to shift onto the right side, so the weight shifts onto the right heel. We're going to turn the frame, turn the body, turn the feet, connect here. So the left side, or the outside facing hand, uh, turns into a tantal, and the right turns into a punch. So you're going to do tantal punch there. So both sides are going to go out, so you're doing tantal punch. Okay, then you're going to come back to the middle. So I've got a helper over here. Um, He's providing commentary. So we're going to come back, we're going to bring our weight now, look, into the middle here. So the center of gravity is over the middle. Make sure we're still connected, hips are turned up, shoulders are back here, and we're going to punch again. Punch again. Then we're going to shift to the left, turn the frame, turn the feet here like that. This side, we're going to, no, this, the, the inside punt, um, arm does a punch and the outside does tanza. Punch there. So we're going to come back to the middle here, again, punch, oh yeah, and again. So when you shift to this side, as you shift, the punching hand is going to turn, rotate like this. As the, as the hip turns, so does that, that my wrist turns over. Here, I'm going to punch and turn out. Okay, come back to the middle, connect, double punch. From here, shift the weight, turn the body, change, okay, this, this turns over, punch, turn this up, there. Okay, so you're just going to keep doing that back and forth, go super slow, don't um, spend too much time, don't, don't um, rush through it rather, so don't feel uh, rushed at all, right? So make sure that you're concentrating on every single aspect of it, particularly the shifting of the weight. So if I'm connecting here, Shift the weight, turn the body, and it will change like this again. So you can break it down, connect the hips, shift the weight, turn the body, feet change like that. Okay, so all I'm doing is I'm moving my root from one side to the other, and then I'm using both sides of my frame to punch to extend that. But one side is doing a tan side, the other side is doing a punch. Okay, you can. Um, you can be either, right? You could do, you could practice this doing palm strikes, punches, double tan sal, uh, double fuk sal. Um, you can do anything you want as long as the frame behind it is okay. But I'll stick to that one for now, right? Do the punch and tan sal, uh, and just keep going over that back and forth, and um, help you. <laughs> you want to say the same, Odin? Yeah. You're gonna come and help me. Uh, anyway, guys, that's enough for today. Um, and then uh, shoot me a comment below if you've got any questions, and we'll talk to you. Alright, bye.